So if you ever have a problem with a 4x4 selector, and most likely that's right here, because this is what's turning your this is what's turning your 4x4 lock differential on the front. And uh, most likely you always come up with a service light. And the service light says, uh, I think, check 4x4 system or 4x4 service. Something like that. So that's most likely failing. And uh, what's fail inside? They just, you know, those uh, plastic gears get wear out. And it's a common problem with the Dutch with the Dutch rum. So what you have to do you have to replace the selector and uh, you can buy this on the eBay, Amazon, those kind of websites. Let's make your job easier. I did remove that before to check and uh, I opened actually this part right here but uh, and what do you do you have to jack up this before you do anything because there's an oil there so make sure it's uh, tilting to the left, I think I put a little silicon. Uh, I gotta jack up a little more. That's for safety. Let's open that. Oh, there's a well. Let me just clean this quickly. It's gonna add a little bit on the differential side later on. All right, so you got an idea. You take this one, you take the old one, you put in the new one. Bolt, bolt, four bolts, easy hookup, nothing crazy. It's nothing crazy. And there's a little bit of oil spill. But... And you gotta talk to the Manufacture torque specification. And the part was uh, was costing I think around seventy dollars. Well not bad. Actually I don't wanna over tie that. It's Chinese sport. I don't know how how long it's gonna last, but I'll let you know exactly.
make sure you clean wipe it see if it leaks and this goes like that this goes here that's the right spot for the and the plug and the lock and that's it this is what's most likely take very quick easy and simple let me try to turn this maybe you guys are gonna hear and this is working or not pretty loud but it's okay as long as it works I don't care I think next one it's gonna be reseal that transmission pan because I see it start leaking I never cracked this open but it's leaking it's you know it's a Dutch or expect the same like other American trucks I required maintenance and uh, and work and uh, it keep you busy basically so assuming it's it's leaking from that silicon gasket that's what's it look like yeah most likely and I gotta change the oil Let me show you because a lot of people can get confused. They think, they think it's that selector what's failing. It's not really. That one is fine. And to, the way easy to figure out if you can just put your truck, if you can lift your rear wheels and the back, and then put your selector on 4x4 four four. and this shaft will be spinning but those wheels on the front won't catch won't take at all because that's the engage that's engage the front actually they did this for uh, fuel efficiency actually and Ford, Ford actually have the idea which is they have a lock differential on the doesn't have a lock differential, they have a wheel hubs locking mechanism and uh, you know they, they liberally redesign that stuff so this is it all right that's all see ya so if there, anybody wants to find out why this is failing let me show you I'm not supposed to open that, but I opened this anyway before. So, you have to require it. Come on. Alright. Alright. Almost got it. That's a quick thing to do like that. And voila. So this is your thing. So you see how that let me put the lights on. How is already tear down and here all those electrical component that's the sensor for if this is engaged disengage and there's a relay I think that's what gets All right. see that's the motor 
water is still fine looks like the brushes is still good that's what's what's causing that right here that's what's everything is screw up we can still probably use the other component put it back here that's all right you know swap it out the parts because it looks like it's the same like the other one probably the same design inside but you see if you try to even spin you see doesn't doesn't even catch and that's the problem yeah it's stuck completely stuck yep all right so that's garbage and uh, we see how's a uh, another Chinese knockoff how long is gonna last we see this is actually original part from uh, Mexico stone rich stone rich yeah. that's a, that was original that was last maybe two years and fail 